Hi everyone, welcome back to Izzy's World. Today we're gonna be discussing baby teeth. super important for holding spaces for the permanent or adult teeth for speaking and for eating if lost too early these adult teeth have no sense of direction where or at what angle to come in baby teeth do have softer and thinner enamel making them more susceptible to decay and some of these teeth will be in your child's mouth until the age of 12 years old so prevention is key even when your infant has a gummy smile and they have no teeth, there are some stuff that you can do to achieve a healthy mouth. After each feeding, you should grab a warm washcloth and just give the gums a wipe. This ensures that your baby isn't going to sleep with a mouthful of sugars from either formula milk or breast milk. When the first teeth do erupt, which will be around four to six months, sometimes later up to a year old, you will want to start brushing with a soft bristled brush. So as per the American Dental Association, it is recommended that you can use fluoridated toothpaste. I just get the children's toothpaste and put a smear on a toothbrush and do circular motions around each surface of the tooth. Once the teeth are touching, you will want to start using floss to clean in between the teeth. Bacteria loves to hide in those small crevices, so it's really good to get in with the floss and get any bacteria out that your child may have sitting in there. Never let your baby go to bed with a bottle of milk as the sugars will cling to your infant's teeth and create an optimal environment for decay. Any untreated cavities in your infant's mouth can cause pain and infection and you really don't want your baby to be in that kind of discomfort at such a young age. They can cause issues for sleep, learning, and eating abilities. This can also lead to problems with the permanent teeth in the future. It is the parent's responsibility to keep your child's teeth clean. So just try being a good role model for your child, brushing your teeth in front of them, flossing in front of them, making it a fun environment for everybody. This way they will want to brush more, floss more, and take their oral health seriously. You will notice at a certain point that your child is gonna wanna do it all on their own. They're gonna wanna floss, they're gonna wanna brush all by themselves. And that's fine, you can let them, but then always make sure that you're going in after and doing it for them again, just to make sure that they're not leaving behind anything and more plaque and bacteria can accumulate. So the first dental exam should be done at around a year old or six months after the first tooth erupts. Cavities are contagious, so you want to make sure that you're not sharing any toothbrushes or water bottles or giving kisses in the mouth even, you know, just stick to the cheek or the forehead because you don't want to be transmitting your cavities to your baby. I hope you guys learned so much from today and I can't wait to see you guys again next week. Thank you.